Hi, Sexy Tacos. I'm in LA. Look, Kayla's here. Well, no, I'm at Kayla's, but <laughs> basically, I've been in LA for a while and I haven't been vlogging. I'm a bad boy. But I basically just came to like uh, get my car fixed because I know an honest, awesome mechanic here. I'll go. Yes, he's awesome. Okay, in Arizona, the mechanic over there told me that it would cost nine hundred to twelve hundred dollars, and I was like, oh, let me call my, my homie. You know, my essay. I call him, and he says, yeah, it'll be about five hundred bucks. And I was like, oh, well, that saves me four hundred to seven hundred bucks. Part of the reason why I came to LA, actually, really large part, was to get my car fixed because I go to this place called Mini Tech. Do you have a sign somewhere? Mini Tech, right there in North Hollywood, and it's a uh, really honest people. What I like about this mechanic right here. Mr. Chessy is that I get to talk to him directly and like a lot of mechanics that I go to I just talk to receptionists and they kind of relay information and I mean really great honest prices, right? Yeah <laughs> Thank you very much Thank you Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. So I drove over and when I was driving over I was like, oh, I got like 60 approximate miles to to go I don't have to put in gas right away and then you know when you when you're doing a long drive I didn't see a gas station for a while, and all of a sudden it says 15 miles, and I'm like, uh-oh. And all of a sudden, it said 5 miles, and it said 0, and I was so scared. I, I called DJ, I was like, yo, DJ, can you look up what to do in this kind of situation? What's my car gonna do? Is, is it gonna stop? Luckily, I came to a rest stop, and I just asked the lady, like, hey, I don't have any gas. And then there's a man coming out, like, Jesus, like, oh! Drive over there to the house. I was like, okay. So I drove over, and then he put in some gas. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I, I have three dollars. <laughs> and he's like, no, no, give it to someone who needs it. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> and then I thought I was like, oh, I should have given that Quest bar in my car oh my because God. nobody can deny food. You know, like food is food, especially a protein bar. So I drove over and I made it to the gas station. I, I was really scared though. It was my first time running out of gas. Have you, you ever run out of gas? No, because I'm responsible. Oh, <laughs> uh, you should what? You shouldn't let it get past a quarter. Yeah, I learned my lesson hard. How was my storytelling? Um, it was okay, you know. I, I felt like it could have used a little more enthusiasm, a little more drama. Oh! Thing is, it's been like uh, a week and a half since it happened, so I kind of lost a lot of the enthusiasm, guys. So thanks thanks for believing in me anyway and sticking around. Thanks for staying subscribed. I actually, I, I, got, uh, I got a little vlog with the mechanic because I, <laughs> and it's so awkward. He, he's like, oh yeah, we'll, we'll be on the video. I'll title it, uh, ran Story out of- Story time, the time I almost got stranded in the desert. Ran out of gas, what to do, no that's what I was thinking. No one's gonna click on that. What? 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 You don't think? I wouldn't click on that. So you're gonna click on when I got stranded in the desert? Yeah. We'll see. I got another vlog that I did with Sears camera where I went to get tacos with its roommate that has never had street tacos. So look forward to that. And if you guys ever got run out of gas, post a comment below telling me if you freaked out. Because I literally, guys, okay, literally, when, when, when I was at like one mile estimation for, for my car, I was like yelling, oh my god, Jesus God, if you're real, come on, please, the one time I need it. I was like, wait, am I like a typical Christian now asking help when I need it? The fact that I actually got gas made me think Maybe there is a god out there, you know? Or maybe it was a really good coincidence. First street taco. Mm -hmm. He's experiencing mm. it.